An employee suffered several injuries at Indiana Beach on Saturday following an incident with a roller coaster car. News 18's Brad Oppenheim joins us with the latest information and how park visitors feel about the incident. Brad? At this point, there are still few details being released about the incident. And after talking to people who have been to the park, some are reconsidering future visits while others are planning on coming back. I hope he's doing well. He's going to have some you know, tough roads ahead of him, but I hope that he, uh, he's able to make a full recovery. Around 1 o'clock Saturday afternoon, the Monticello Fire Department responded to Indiana Beach after receiving reports of a man struck by a roller coaster car. The man was taken to IU Health White Memorial Hospital before being airlifted to an Indianapolis hospital after sustaining multiple injuries. Park officials said on Saturday that the man is a mechanic and was working on the Cornball Express roller coaster. Following the incident, safety concerns were being raised by some. Beth Delgado was at the park on Sunday with her family. She says she was unaware of what happened until News 18 informed her. I think that the more information the public can know would be better, especially when we're dealing with safety of our children and ourselves, you know, at an amusement park. I think they should definitely be more upfront with the information. Delgado says after hearing the news, she's not sure she'll be heading back to the park anytime soon. It depend on um, what the story was. Was it negligence or was it really a ride that malfunctioned? I think it is important information to know. On the other hand, some people aren't concerned about park operations. Dean Harrison has two children who work at the park. They spend their days off there going on the rides. It's not a concern. I'm not worried about you know, them being hurt you know, riding any of the rides. He says the incident won't stop him and his family from visiting the park in the future. I feel safe with them. I go there with my wife. You know, we go on the rides and we enjoy it. Uh, it's just a shame that it's happened. Um, I think that the park is doing whatever they have to do to make the ride safe you know, for all the, the guests. As of Monday, Indiana Beach officials say they have no further comment about the incident. News 18 has also reached out to the park owners for comment, but still have yet to hear back. Brad Oppenheim, News 18.